Today, Kevin and I are gonna be reviewing some Coco Shop. These are uh, hot chocolates. They're limited edition, all three of them are. Uh, we have the uh, chocolate vanilla toffee, the chocolate caramel truffle, and the chocolate mayan spiced. These were $3.99 each at Home Goods, And they are made by McStevens in Washington, and their website is www.mcstevens.com. And so um, I, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and add the, and my water's hot, so I'm gonna go ahead and add my chocolate to each one of my cups here. What I did was it said to measure um, two to three tablespoons or 35 grams in each one. And so I actually weighed these out and it was almost three full tablespoons is what I, I weighed. But look how dark that is very very dark i'm gonna stir these really well but we'll talk about calories and stuff like that when we get over to the table but i just wanted to show you uh, what it looks like when you add it to your water and it did specifically say to use water it did not say use milk so we always followed the directions so that mayan spice is really really dark it's the darkest one here uh, so we're going to get these over to the table and we'll be right back so while I was making mine so that the bag wouldn't flop over, I put the packaging down in this glass. And so when uh, we're finished, I'll put a piece of tape on it, put it back in the, the bag and it'll hold it well. Um, it's funny because it's, it says on the bag that the bag, the mixture is made in the United States, the, in Washington. The, um, the bag is, it came from China, so I just thought that was funny. Um, they're all, printing. yeah, they're all the same amount of calories. They're all, it says 2.5 tablespoons, 35 grams, 140 calories. So we're gonna try the chocolate vanilla toffee first. It smells incredible. Each one of these smell incredible. It was assembled in the U.S. though. That's good. Okay. I, I, I'm gonna see if you say it tastes the same as me because like I looked for the ingredient that I tasted and it's in there. I just taste cocoa and like a vanilla. Okay, I tasted coconut, um, and it does yeah, have. A little touch of coconut. It says contains milk and coconut oil. Yeah, that's what that tastes like taste, to me. Taste a touch of it now it, that you mentioned it. it. To me, it's overwhelmingly coconut. I just taste the vanilla more than anything. I get the vanilla, but to me, the vanilla is secondary. To me, this should have been called something with coconut. What's sad is the chocolate's not a really strong flavor. No. <laughs> Instead of chocolate vanilla, they should have called it coconut vanilla. Yeah. And that's really would be a very minor chocolate flavor. To people like my aunt, that would be very disappointing if she didn't read that on the back because she doesn't like coconut at yeah. all. Yeah, so if you try that, you're going to get a little bit of a coconut. You're going to get a coconut flavor, and you're not going to like it if you don't like coconut. Yeah. So, that's... Uh, that well, I'm disappointed that the chocolate flavor is not better. Oh, I, yeah. I like I like chocolate in my chocolate milk and or chocolate cocoa or whatever. Um, I like chocolate. That doesn't really have a chocolate flavor. I personally like it. I think it's, it's good. Okay. But it's not the name on the back. Yeah, it's, it's okay. It's not bad. Okay, the next one is chocolate caramel truffle. Yeah, no, this one I'm looking forward to. Mm. I love that one. Mm -hmm. that and it flavor. has a very strong caramel flavor, yes. It's incredibly sweet. We, you saw what we put in here, Shay. Nothing. You know, sometimes <laughs> when you buy like when you buy like raw cocoa, like the Hershey's oh, you cocoa, put sugar in. you have to put sugar in it. When you're making your own uh, on a cold winter day, and you come in from shoveling snow or playing in the snow, and you make that Hershey's cocoa, and you have to add lots of sugar to it. This, you don't need any sugar at all to it. That's why I always use Nestle Quick. And it's with water, <laughs> and it's delicious. It is good. It still doesn't have any chocolate water. Uh, I no, you taste honestly. It's all, it's all uh, caramel. caramel and, and a little one. coconut. Oh no! See, I didn't get the I coconut, got a coconut on that one. That one too. I wonder if this one. Yeah, this one has milk and coconut oil. But for me, I did not taste coconut at all in that I, one. My, I only taste caramel. I didn't get it while I was drinking it, but I can taste coconut now. Oh really? Like as, as an after. Okay. See, I didn't on that one. So that's funny that, that we're different on that. Yeah. Okay. So this is the main spice. Like any of these. 
and uh, well, this one has coconut oil too. We'll see if we can taste it. The difference between the, the main spice, it has ground cinnamon, allspice, nutmeg, and clove. So it has all of those spices in it. Oh, okay. It's nice. It, it's kind. Of, it's a very seasonal flavor. It's very it uh, it Christmassy. Tastes, it tastes cri like Christmas. Yeah. Yeah. It still doesn't taste like chocolate. It no. <laughs> it, this tastes like something if you were gonna have the ladies over for like a little Christmas get to get together and it was like themed. This would be the one to have because this one actually says Christmas. This yeah. one with those spices in it, and you really taste. The cinnamon and the nutmeg. I'm, I get more nutmeg than anything. Yes, the like nutmeg the is the flavor. strongest. Yes, but um, but yes. It, it's good. I w I truly wish all these had more of a chocolate flavor. I really, I'm, that's what I'm disappointed in. I, I when I want chocolate, I want chocolate, and these really don't have a. I mean, you can taste chocolate in them, but they're not really like a strong chocolate. Right. It's the other flavors that are coming through stronger. Right. Um, this I would not want all the time. Oh, no, I would because not it's a very special specialized flavor. Uh, so I understand why it's limited edition. I don't know why the other ones are limited edition. I, I don't know what they normally right, make. Um, yeah, but uh, this is one that I definitely wouldn't want all the time because I wouldn't want those spices all the no. time. But like for Christmas, it is perfect. The first one, for me, like I said, it's more coconut than anything, so I wouldn't choose that one. My choice would be the chocolate the caramel, caramel truffle, and it's really just caramel. My, that out of the three, if I, I wouldn't buy any of them again, to be honest with you. But if uh, if I had to pick one, it'd be the common one as well. Yeah. Yeah. I still think I'd put a little spoonful of chocolate. In. <laughs> and truth be told, when we picked these up at Home Goods, Kevin thought they were bags of candy. Yeah, I thought so, they were just chocolate. So he thought that we were bringing home three bags full of little chocolates. Yeah, and you didn't know either. And I didn't know either. And then we got home, and I was doing the grocery haul, and it's like. Nope, I think you one. said, I think you said during that grocery haul, I wonder if that's hot chocolate. And I picked it up during that haul and it's like, oh yeah, well I guess we bought hot chocolate. Um, so Well, the, after I look, because when you're in the store, you're just looking at all this stuff and you're overwhelmed. Right, there's so, a lot. Yeah. So they have a lot of stuff that mixes in. I, I thought they could be candy because a lot of the packages are small like this. Yes. And then when I got it home, it's like, you know what, that does not look like it would hold candy. Well, it, it can hold little candy bars. So that's funny that we were trying hot chocolate. We hadn't even planned on it. Uh, but if you know, um, if you're familiar with the Mick Stevens company, then maybe you know of other uh, uh, flavors that they sell. You might have your favorites and you can let us know in the comments below because we would like to hear about it. So I hope you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching. <laughs>